Hey guys, so today I'm going to be giving you guys a Swift Soul Premium tutorial. So you want to start out by opening the app and heading over to profiles. Now I already created a profile right here with random information, but you guys of course want to put your actual information. And then you could go to the top right and click these blue arrows to add five random characters after your address and a random phone number. As you see, those two spots both get changed every single time I tap the blue arrows. What this helps you with is minimalizing your cancels on Supreme, allowing you to get multiple orders of the same item. Now let's head over to proxies. Now I inputted a bunch of random proxies here, which um, all of them work on Supreme as you could tell with the millisecond times. So we want to create a new task, get these boxers, use this new profile and select a random proxy. So I will save task and now we can see if the proxy works or not by clicking start. And we can see that the proxy works because it goes all the way to checkout. And of course the item's not going to go through because all the information is random. But the proxy clearly works and Swiftsoul can handle it. So now let's go create a new task with the same new profile and a random proxy. Save the task and go check out the multi-cart feature. So basically what you could do here is click the cart button on the top right and drag an item from a different cart into a cart with another item. So basically what this does is it allows you to cut down on shipping as it splits it for each of the items. So now instead of paying $10 for each item, you pay $10 for both of them. So now what would happen if, is if I started one of the tasks, then both of them would start. As we see, the t-shirts are out of stock, but the boxes are picked up and they're getting added to cart. And we're already at checkout, but it's not going to go through because the information is random. Another new feature is background mode, which basically means I can start a task, close out of the app, and I'll get a notification once the capture is ready for me to solve it. We see right there, capture is going to appear. I had a one click and the checkout's not going to go through once again. The advantage of background mode is that you could also run manual on your phone, but you'll get a notification once the capture is there, so you already know that your bot's at checkout. So you could quickly go check out on your bot and go check out manually and get two items. Finally, we could check out the unlimited tasks. So basically what Swift Soul Premium lets you do is create as many tasks as you want, and they'll run as long as your phone can handle it. So basically what I'll do now is create a bunch of tasks and then just clone them. So regular Swift Soul only lets you run eight tasks, but as you can see here, I have 10 tasks ready to go. And as long as my phone can handle them, these could potentially all become checkouts. Thanks for watching guys. Hope this helped you out.